We all know the camera angles. They're fucking broken in Modern Warfare. This is a light representation. I know you've seen a couple videos of how bad the camera angles are in Modern Warfare. But I kind of wanted to take a step further. So right here you can see, I can see at least half of his body. You can see from the right side all the way up and down, cut him in half. I can see his whole body, but he can't see none of me. It's very prevalent when you get, have a uh, very thin cover for some reason. You can see it a lot better. But when you're pushed up against the wall like this, you can literally not see the other player behind the wall. You can see my smoke grenade right there, but you literally cannot see any of my character. And I have to push out quite a bit for you to see me. Right now you can see about a third of my character still. You can see my, my whole arm, half of my head, some of my uh, right side of my body and my whole leg. You can see all of that with these bad camera angles. I don't know what happened when they made the new engine or whatever, but right now you can see his whole side, right side of the body. And I don't understand why this is. This has got me killed so many times where I can't see the other player, but they can see me. So how does this relate to older Call of Duties? I really wanted to test this. So I hopped on uh, World War II and I kind of did the same test. I wanted to see if these uh, camera angles are really that bad. So here I'm on shipment and I just find a good little corner and go over to this little spot over here and what you're going to see is very surprising this is what I talk about arcade versus realism Call of Duty is bad about realistic games they should just keep arcade shooters they should just stick to arcade shooters it's more fun yes the strafing is a little bit too fast in the game but if you ever played Crate, hello Modern Warfare strafing is out of this world speed in Crate. so Right here, pushed up against the wall, same thing, but actually I have less less on my screen. I can't see that much on my right side, but I can still see this player. Now, yeah, you can see uh, my upper chest, my arms and everything, and I can see his legs. So this was kind of a bad test right here. So now I go to another wall, same thing, cover, everything. I can see his right elbow. You will be able to see his right leg. But here's the thing, even though I can't see his head, the one that does more damage in Modern Warfare, not in this game, headshots doesn't count that much. So it really doesn't matter in this game. But in Modern Warfare where headshots do about double the damage, I can't see it. But he can still see me. So we see each other, but he can't see my head. Good game design? Is this better or worse? I, I'm on the fence about it. I think there should be a happy medium. I think it should be changed a little bit. But yes, World War II does have a weird camera angle. It is kind of weird. I, I, but the thing is, I can't see his eyes unless he can see me fully. So if I look at his eyes, he, he's already able to see me. So peripherals, realism, whatever. I don't know exactly how to code or how you know developers make these games but right here he can see he can see my eyes right you can see my head but I can't see him right I can't see his head right here I can barely see his head his head's moving a little bit but he can't see my head unless I aim down for some reason so these camera angles I feel like you know are a little bit better uh, I can see his leg and he can't see none of my body. That's fine because those are limbs and sometimes your arm or leg or whatever, some of your body is exposed. But when you just have your half of your body is exposed and you, one of your eyes is looking at the enemy and you can't see the enemy still because those broken camera angles, I think it should be fixed. I think it should have been fixed a long time ago. They should have changed it, but that's just my two cents. Just let me know in the comments down below. Did you like this video? What can I do differently? How can I improve? And uh, thank you for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.